The 2014 Edelman Trust Barometer shows the largest ever gap between trust in business and government since we began the study 14 years ago. Globally, business has a 14-point trust advantage over government. In more than half of the 27 nations surveyed, business has a significant trust advantage with the gap exceeding 20 points in 11 of the markets. Business should not misinterpret this as an opportunity to push for deregulation. In this complex environment, almost half of the public wants greater government regulation of business, especially in less trusted industries, such as financial services or in geographies that have faced scrutiny. For example, in China, where there has been food safety issues, 84% call for greater government regulation of the food and beverage industry. Businesses now have not only the permission to engage on development of corporate regulation, but are expected to do so. Eight in 10 respondents believe business has a role in developing regulation. Businesses should support regulation in partnership with government and other key stakeholders, such as NGOs, which is consistently the most trusted of all institutions. But business still has work to do as trust in the institution remains low. Just over half of our global respondents trust the institution at all, and some markets, like the US, Singapore, and Mexico, experience significant declines in trust in the institution. There are four factors that shape trust in business, and within them some trends that should be observed. Technology remains the most trusted industry, while financial services remains the least. Companies based in brick markets continue to suffer trust deficits, with global trust levels at half those of Western markets. Small, medium, and family-owned enterprises tend to be more trusted than big business, and state-owned enterprises suffer from lack of trust globally. We continue to see a crisis of trust in the leadership of business, with one in five people trusting a business leader to tell the truth, and CEOs having low credibility compared to other potential spokespeople. In order to build trust, CEOs must embrace transparent communications and engage key stakeholders such as employees and NGOs. Protecting consumer data, respecting employee rights, and managing a responsible supply chain are three behaviors that will have positive impact on public perceptions, improve a business's integrity, and therefore build trust. Trust has always driven action and enabled successful long-term relationships. Now trusted businesses must go one step further and create the context for positive widespread change.